Finally. That took way too long. What we did? <gasps> Ooh, a twad? Oh, it's just a one star. Whatever. What if that was like something cool, like a twad fifty twenty five? Oh, I would have lost my shit. Right here in this video. How fitting would it be that we did a ten mil pistol? Excuse me. What? What? What is going on, guys? And that you're back again with another video for you guys. And today we have a bloodied Vats crit stealth field. Uh, 10 millimeter pistol now still feel it's it's okay. It's okay. Like it's a decent effect But when you're a stealth gorilla build like myself um, You know the stealth field Doesn't really do that much for you because you're supposed to be always in stealth anyway, but it Is what it is I guess um, And there are the mods down there. I might change the true drip honestly um to something else, I don't know. No, I mean, the true drip uh, gives us hip, uh, superior hip fire accuracy, so I'll probably keep it. Probably keep it. So I don't know if you can tell or not, but I am I am using a different uh, way of recording my audio because Audacity has really been dropping the ball for me lately. It's always been like <sighs> rendering my audio with, into like a slower, like, what I. <laughs> I don't know, into like a, sl uh, like a slower pace and it like messes up the timing that I have to pair it with the video. So now I'm just recording with the uh, recording thing that uh, Eldado has. Um, and I did it like one time before, but it like it was like kind of weird um, the last time I did it. Um, at least in my opinion, I, I didn't really like notice anything like coming from a uh, reaction or whatever. But... Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go with it. Hopefully this works out and uh, yeah, I won't have to use audacity anymore to line stuff up because it, if I do it this way I don't even have to line anything up. I just uh, put it in the uh, you know, tie it up into just, just Vegas and put the music underneath it or the background music and uh, You know, we're good to go I made sure to put the right parts on this time. I had Dunslinger on Because uh, I was doing a Dunslinger, a Dunslinger ugh. Because I was doing a Dunslinger video, and, uh, yeah, so I had to swap him out for Gorilla. Also, I don't understand why he's holding a Uzi when there's not even Uzi in this game, but, you know, it's whatever. Pretty sure you guys have already seen the perk cards, but that's my perks. Put on follow-through. I have always, I always have to put on follow-through doing a stealth video, because I always, like, day-to-day -day I run with my, my flamethrower. So that's why I have uh, Data One of the team always on. Also, speaking of team, I should probably be on a team. So that my special stats are like not as bad. Let me zoom out for whenever I do go on third person. I really wish the Molemire Treasure Hunter event was up, uh, because. Uh, gives us something to do, something to grind for at least. Um, I, I didn't realize it was gone. Uh, I thought it was going to leave on a Tuesday, which makes sense because that's when, you know, usually the, the time for shit changes in this game. Um, but it, it, it happened on Monday. I was like, damn, bro, because I sold a, wow, okay. Got a lucky rocket and killed me. Okay, well that's annoying, so let me place down my tent real quick, and of course I'm using my asbestos and not my dents, but uh, we will quickly change that. There we go. Also, this is almost broken. This one's fine. Okay, and now I gotta get back into the Nerd Rage. There we go. But anyway, like I was saying, I wish it was still here because I just sold a bloodied faster fire rate uh, movement speed fixer, and I sold it to a guy for a thousand caps, or not a thousand caps, but um, max caps, because uh, I don't know, I didn't think it was worth max caps. It was maybe like almost there, so you know, 
And he really seemed like he wanted it, so... I mean, you know, I wasn't going to say no to him. Uh, and I wanted to buy a lot of the, uh, the, the, the pails. The mail... Well, how are you seeing me? I'm in danger now. How am I in danger, game? Escape artist, are you working? Hello? But... I sold all those caps, thinking that the treasure hunter thing was still up, and then I was going to buy a bunch of pails, but, uh... Here I am, I didn't get the pails, because it wasn't up, so, you know. Because I was missing, like, the two plushies, the plan for the two plushies, I think there was, maybe, maybe there was three plans, or three plushies, I'm not really sure. Uh, but I was missing all of them. I'm not really like big on the plushies. The one I, the one I really wanted was the camo backpack, and I ended up buying that for like 15k. So I mean, honestly, I don't think that was really worth my purchase. Uh, I didn't, I didn't really end up liking it as much as I thought I would. But, uh, but at least I have it now. I still do like, uh, well. Actually, I like this one now. The one I'm wearing, the uh, Vault Survivor backpack. I think this thing looks dope, and it fits this game so well. Um, it would be... It kind of would go... Eh, maybe not. I was going to say it would go well if you were, like, role-playing as a Vault head, you know, employee or whatever, but uh, then if you were... Uh, if you were... Uh, role playing with a vault tech employee, then I guess you would uh, would be wearing like a suit or something. Well, maybe not. Maybe you might be wearing a vault suit, but it goes with the 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 suit in the uh, in the sportboard. But I really don't like the not suit, but uh, costume, outfit, whatever. Um, I don't really, you know, I don't really care for that outfit. It's like kind of eh, whatever. But I think it goes well with uh, this outfit that I'm currently wearing. Which is like a cultist type outfit because it looks like, you know, with this outfit on, you're like kind of a raider and, you know, you've seen some shit. And then this, this is, this backpack makes it look like you've seen some shit and, you know, you're ready to go through some shit. Because you got the axe on the end there, you know, you're prepared, you got the, the sleeping bag or whatever the hell that is on the bottom. And you got your ropes, you want to grapple onto something, I don't know. But I think that backpack looks, that backpack looks dope. I really wish they would bring back the uh, the pack rat backpack in the Atomic Shop. I don't know why I didn't buy that when I had the chance. I really should have. I really liked it. Um, maybe at the time I didn't really like, see a use for it because I didn't see any outfits uh, that I wanted to go along with it. But now I know. Well, I know there was one that I had that I wanted to use, but now that. <laughs> Now that it's no longer in the Thomas shop and I can't find it anywhere, um, I guess just had to buy. I figured I'd cut this part out to where I actually get to the back of the less tech instead of doing that awkward, like, silent run all the time. You know, I just get straight to the action. Oh. Okay, well, that works too. Sit down, dog. Okay, dog's up there. Oh, he ran away. Miss my jetpack so much, man. Okay. You know, I actually start or thought about this earlier. Um, since you know we have the expeditions coming up, and it's in the pit. Um, you know, the pit's going to be highly irradiated, irradiated. Uh, so, like. I wonder how how much 
it'll be radiated. Like, will I need more radiation protection? Uh, because I, I've I've noticed. Well, I I knew I've known this for a while, but um, maybe I should you know start crafting for all Secret Service armor pieces because of the radiation resistance that you get from it. Whereas now, like, I think I have. Yeah, I have 30 radiation resistance because my armor basically gives off, like, no radiation resistance. Uh, the only 30 I think I get from is from my my robot arm. Oh, apparently it's from something else, too. What could that be from? Hmm. I don't know. Oh, it might be from my... Might be from this. Yeah, it is. It's from my Secret Service Under Armour. Ooh, Jailbreak. I haven't seen that show up in a long time. Yeah, so I basically get 30. I get, thir I get 15 from my right arm, and then... Where the hell is Swan at? Oh, there he is. He's actually up and moving now. Come here, buddy. But yeah, like at um, what is it? Was the event Heart of the Swamp? Like I cannot stand in front of that uh. Front of that uh, strangle heart thing as long as I used to I used to just be able to stand in front of it no problem when it's like shooting out the radiated you know mist um, but now I have to be extra cautious of what I'm doing and I take I taste like fucking it, it's a stupid amount of radiation I taste like 15 radiation or something like that whenever that happens so I have to be like kind of like far away if I'm, I'm doing it in battle armor you know it's fine it, it's no big deal because power armor, you know, you only get one. I'm pretty sure power armor has like a thousand radiation resistance um, across all of them. Maybe, I don't know. I'm not really big on power armor. I never really like learned about power armor or like what's the best power armor or, or whatever until I'm getting ready to use that power armor. And then I do my research. Oh, great. Now I'm out of a AP. Need to triple the spell real quick. Oh no. I got sta- Really? I got staggered and I couldn't run. Every time I do a- Every time I do a video, she is doing something stupid. She got her health back for some reason. That's a great bug game. you imagine trying to do this at full health? I would not be able to do it. Did you? Whatever. Alright, well. I thought there was another another change somewhere. Um... And also, I know there's some crackheads over here. I thought there were. Yeah, there's a tin over there. So maybe I should just, you know, keep searching for some Secret Service uh, armor, like keep crafting for them and stuff. Just for the resistances and whatnot. Well, I wasn't paying attention there. Thankfully, my mutation saved me. Another hatchling, I'm gonna kill it for the SP. So I'm suffering from the blight. So that means my perception is 32. That's, that's okay, I guess. Whatever. So I wonder if I can hurry up and kill this torch beast. Not have any problems. Uh, but for some reason, my bullets just don't want to hit. 
Not there. Yay, I'm in danger. Now I'm back in caution. My shots are whiffing. Oh my goodness. Where is... Hope you don't mind me getting a little bit more XP and get you to mutate real quick. Okay, that's not good. Yeah, you land real quick. As soon as I can get my AP back and just unload. Uh, what? Finally. That took way too long. Well, we did- Oh, a quad? Oh, it's just a one star. Whatever. What if that was like something cool, like a quad 50, 25? Oh, I would have lost my shit. Right here in this video. How fitting would it be that we get a 10 mil pistol? Excuse me? What? What? Okay. Can you, can one of you teach me how you just did that? Okay. Alright guys, there you have it. A bloodied Vats Crit Stealth Field, uh, or Ghost, I guess people call it. Um, 10 millimeter pistol. It's, it's alright. As you saw there, I, str I struggled against, um, my Lord Queen. Um, you know, I... I don't think it really, sh I mean, it kind of struggled, but it made sense that it's a pistol, but, um, it kind of struggled a little bit against the storage piece to, but it was, it was fine once I was actually able to get it landed, or get the storage piece land on, landed on the ground, um, it was alright, I just, I don't know, the ma it's all about the mag size, and that's why, I, that's why if I really wanted a pistol, I want a quad one, because, that extra ammo capacity is really essential, especially for like a pistol. Especially when you're only, when you only have like, I think it's 12? Yeah, 12 bullets and a mag. Um, you know, that's really crucial. Uh, but yeah, once again guys, thank you guys for watching, have a nice day. I'll see you in the next video, peace out. Also, if you're, if you're wanting this pistol, uh, I'm on Xbox, there's my gamer tag on the bottom left. If you want this pistol, I can probably let it go for about 1500, 2000 caps. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.